Hi friends, my name is Tapan Kapadia from HSW Embroidery Machines. Welcomes you back to our channel. Hi friends, today we are going to show you a product which is useful to each and every people residing in India. This product will save your all kind of electric appliances. So, if you want to see what is the product, please stay up to the end and during the product, we will ask you a question and whoever will answer the question, the first three commenters will get the free gift from the company. So please tune with us till the end. Hi friends, me Tapan Kapadia back with a new product in HSW Embroidery Feather. So today we are going to show you the HSW safeguard this product as i told before this product is not only for hsw embroidery machine but it can be used by any kind of embroidery machine as well as it can be used in any kind of electric appliances like tv fridge washing machine microwave or teaching machine sewing machine any kind of electric appliances can be used this will save your product and how it does we talk about it normally in india all the electric appliances are make with the power electricity resistance of 280 watt most of the companies make it with the 280 watt of power resistance but to save that we use stabilizer or ups that stabilizer or ups is built to protect your appliances a 240 plus or minus 50 watt or if it is a very good quality then it will protect up to 100 watt but what happens when the electricity is cut off and sudden electricity comes at that time mostly the power flow is more than 330 or more than 300 and at that time the ups or your uh, stabilizer sometimes it doesn't work and it bypass the electricity and that time your appliances get damaged and we have seen in our uh, record that so many times by using electricity appliances like stabilizer and UPS, still the products are damaged with the electricity high flow. So this product actually work as when input voltage is touch 276 watt, this device will cut the electricity supply and it will stop for two minutes and after two minutes it will start again the another plus point about this device is it also shows that the earthing of your electric appliance is proper or the neutral and reverse wire in your electric board is proper so this device work in two ways it will also show you the earthing reverse and neutral and also save your electric appliances so in further video we will show you how it actually works so here we are to test how actually the safeguard works so for testing we have some props so i will introduce the props what are the props are here so the first thing we have a switchboard over here in which the neutral and reverse as well as the earthing is perfect and second switchboard is here which doesn't have a proper earthing so and another thing we have is the variac so this variac will show the input voltage in the bulb and here is the bulb so now what we do is first we give electric supply to the variac from the switchboard which is perfect now we have given an electric supply to the variac right now the input voltage is 256 and here you can see the knob as if i move this knob on the left side you can see the voltage input supply will reduce gradually and if I turn it on the right side, if I move it on the right side, the voltage supply will increase. So now what we do is from Variac, we will give power supply to our safeguard like this. Now as soon as we have given power supply to the safeguard, you can see the yellow light is on. So now, whenever you start device for the first time, it means the device is reset. 
so it will take 2 minutes to pass on the power supply so you can see here the yellow light is on and the second light output on is off right now because the power supply is not passing further the third light you can see is high voltage and the fourth light you can see is neutral and earthing test and over here you can see the earthing test switch so now as soon as i press the switch you can see the blue light has turned on that means that earthing and neutral reverse electric supply is perfect if on the pressing of earthing test if this blue light is not on that means neutral or electric reverse supply has some problem now we change this supply to the board which doesn't have a neutral reverse or a earthing proper so now i will give electric supply to the variac from the another board see now i have changed the board and the electric board which is over here where we have taken the electricity that doesn't have a proper earthing reverse or a neutral reverse properly so now when i press this earth test you can see that blue light is not on that means the neutral reverse or earthing is not proper so that how you check the neutral reverse and earthing so now i will show how exactly the device will work now again we will give electricity from the perfect board so i change the electricity supply to the perfect board so now input supply is on and we will give supply to this electric bulb from the device so now you can see that input supply is on output is off because as i said you when you give them a supply for the first time then it takes 2 minutes to pass on the power supply and you can see that the wattage supply is around 246 so let's wait for the power supply to get on till that time i, I will let you know in which device you can use this product you can use this device in any electrical appliances the only condition is that this device is made for 1000 watt that means 1 kilowatt product electric appliance only you can use this in television in washing machine you can use this in a sound bar or any kind of electric appliances it will keep your electric appliance safe so now let's wait for output electricity to start so now you can see that light is on and over here you can see the output is on right now we will increase the input voltage slowly so right now the input voltage is 243 so now we will increase it gradually so that you come to know the what is the exact effect so see right now we are taking straight away to 263 now we will gradually increase it see up to 274 our bulb is on now 275 as soon as it crossed 276 the light is off and over here you can see high voltage is on and this sign will be on till the time the voltage will go down so now we will gradually lower down the voltage so as soon as it comes to 266 means now the voltage is in such condition that your electric appliance can uh, usable so now you can see that high voltage light is off but device will take two minutes to further supply the electricity so now we have to wait for two minutes so till that time i let you know if you want to buy this device then there is a link given in a description box you can buy it from amazon and flipkart
and also you can visit your local electrical store to buy this device. So guys, if you feel that this device is useful to you, then what you are waiting for? Just click on the link given and go away and straight away buy it. If you feel this device is useful to any of your friend, then please share this video to your friend so that he can save his electric appliances. And if you like this video, then please subscribe our channel. Please press the red button so that whenever we introduce a new product or whenever we give a new video, you get a notification. Now guys, you can see that electric bulb is on. So now the power supply is regular 250, 253 and output is on. So that's how exactly this device work. Now coming to the end, as I have mentioned before in a video that at the end of the video, we will ask a question. So the question for today is that what reaction will device give if the earthing is not proper? Please leave your answer in a comment box and we will select randomly any three people and we will give them this safeguard totally free and you have to answer it before 1st of September. So guys, what you think about this device? Also let us know in a comment box and thank you very much for today.